So how many of you can write? I don't mean just like a research paper. I mean like your thoughts down on in paragraph form. You could write, if I asked you to sit down and write a well thought through goals document on what you would like to achieve in two pages, how many of you would feel like, yeah, I could write that and would actually be proud to read it aloud in front of the class? Okay, good. All right. That is scary that only one hand went up. <laughs> I mean that with a lot of love. We did an internship program with the, the first, we, we've actually done, I think, four rounds of this internship program. It's very heavy, intensive content. You're and each person's writing about three blog posts, blog articles a week, um, and then it ends with them writing a large research, called an e-book, like a white paper, which we'll talk about a little bit later. Out of ten interns from Cameron, how many do you think could write? One. You're right. One could write. And I don't mean like extremely well. I mean to the ability that I would be willing to send one of their emails to a client. That was concerning. We basically only asked one person to come back to our company out of 10. These are great people too, very smart, had nothing to do with their intellect. Just their ability to write was so crucial. I was talking to an employer in town who is a partner in a firm. Uh, he just actually, his LinkedIn told me he hit his 10 year mark this month at this firm. And he was telling me about a new hire. He was saying, you know, yeah, this guy is awesome. You know, he, we're gonna call him Jeff for now, um, the new hire. So he was like, Jeff is great. You know, he's very personable. He dresses to the part. You know, he, it's a financial firm, so they work with a lot of high network, you know, rich people that have large amounts of money. And he was talking about how they manage, you know, this is something that they help manage their wealth. You know? So it's something that there's a lot of communication that goes back and forth and very regular. And he was saying in person, this guy's great. You know, they'll talk with the clientele, the clientele like him, you know, they actually trust him pretty quickly. Because however, when it comes to emails, I could ring his neck. Because if this guy cannot write seeking professional email to save his life. He's like, we email our clientele daily. So that's a huge concern for me. And he goes, this is pretty typical from what we've seen time and time again from graduates. Now we can go and point, picture, point fingers at the institutions, at the university, at schools, whatever. But honestly, writing takes practice. 